Hi everybody, this is Sam with Python Basics, and we are going to be now delving more into problem solving and how to think through a problem. We are going to come up with a test a um, for a palindrome, and a palindrome is something that's the same forward and backwards. So right now we're just going to do the test to see if something's a palindrome. So we have to come we have to use what we already know and then derive from those bits of information we already know about Python. I'll show you two different ways. Um, just so you can start getting in your head about how to take the items that we already have, the methods and the predetermined functions to solve things. So Let's just get started. So, palindrome. It's uh, same forwards and backwards. So, BOB. It's same thing, forwards and backwards. So, what is a way that we could do this? So, let's think about our slicing. So, all right, that may not look like much, but how will we use, uh, let's change this and do Sam, so we can see. So, all right, let's go over this again so you can see. So then what you do is you do a test to see if these are the exact same forwards and backwards. And then we can build upon this and build maybe a function that can test if input is a palindrome. So all right, let's let's just kind of start over. All right, this right here is our slicing. And if it only has one instance, oops, all right. So if it only takes one input, it's just the instance. But if it uses the one colon, it goes start to finish. And I have I have a video on this, so you, you can you can look up a slicing. But what this is saying is the step. It's saying minus one. So that's reverse. So that's what this does so we go all the way do you remember to remind you that says go all the way start at zero go all the way to the end but so then how would we do this so we just saw how to do it backwards so we go anybody got any guesses so if we have this we have to do our two equal signs and we go x boom this is our is equal. So we have our Bob, then we have our Bob in reverse, and we can test this. We can do y minus one, false, and y was Sam. So now this was just a little warm up. What we'll do is then we'll actually start to build this and go through and take input from the user and then do the test but this is a quick and simple and easy way to test if something is a palindrome and this is a way to print something out in reverse so thanks for watching hope you guys are getting something out of this don't forget to click the subscribe button and uh, we'll build on this next time thanks